Maybe I can convince them. Do not students take what they learn from their teachers? What then if the teacher is wrong? Does that not simply perpetuate these wrong teachings amongst future generations? You assume the students aren't wise enough to understand the flaws of the teacher. Think of those who came before us. First Thales, then his student Anaximandros, and then Anaximenes. Without the teachings of those before him, it's safe to say Anaximenes would not have reached the conclusions he did. I don't think that's true at all. Oh, perhaps this new phase can offer a different perspective. A student gets to take all the knowledge of their teacher without needing to come up with answers themselves. If they're smart, they should surpass those they studied under. An astute observation. The time saved by receiving the knowledge allows the student not only to expand on the ideas, but to come up with more of their own. But what if the student expands on ideas without first seeking the truth behind them? If we listen to others and take what they say as fact, we only have ourselves to blame. So, no matter who is speaking, student or teacher, we must spend time trying to understand if what they say is even true. Your appearance betrays you, Mystius. Clearly, you've taken on a teacher of your own. Something like that is the reason I'm here. Socrates needs your help. Socrates? Ha! <laughs> if it's another debate you want, it will be hard for us to decide who hates that man more. Why would we help him? It doesn't matter if he's your worst enemy. If they're willing to imprison someone like Socrates only for his words, what's to say they won't do the same to you? So, you want us to help out of fear of being imprisoned ourselves? I don't care why you help. If I hadn't said his name, would you think it was right Socrates was locked up? If it's as you say, and it was for his words, then no. And aren't you afraid it could happen to you too? Of course. If we can't speak our minds, what else are we to do? If you believe that, then you should help. Fine, fine, you've made your point, and you've made it well. Socrates deserves our help, but we don't give it lightly. That makes it worth even more. We'll be on our way, then. We'll gather some others as well, make sure our voices are heard. Believe it or not, we're pretty good at causing a scene. If you're like Socrates, that's not hard to believe. Wow, I've never seen someone convince them so easily before. Is that so? I guess I should feel proud. I'm surprised to see a child here. Is there an age at which it would suddenly be okay to debate with them? What then of the night before I turn that age? Should we be prevented from doing what... Well, I better hurry after the others. Here! Fasten, or please.